everybody, KOE here. So this is going to be a first impressions video because Sega was kind enough to give us a free copy to the new Demon Slayer game, the Hinokami Chronicles. Hini Utsuru wa Regen no Mai. Hini Adoru wa Rekisen no Yu. Tsumugareru Tsuamono no Kankai. Ikuemono Yish, Genkon no Kateto Nari. おりを滅する力となら as you might have noticed, this is a game that is developed by Cyber Connect 2, the creators of games like the Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm series. They've also created games like Asura's Wrath, and honestly, that's kind of apparent here when they made the Demon Slayer game. This game is absolutely gorgeous and holds its hand very close to the fact that it is a faithful recreation of the anime. There are 18 playable characters from the first episodes of the anime all the way to the end of the Mugen Train arc, with a handful of those characters available from the Kimitsu Academy miniseries that they wound up having as a spin-off. The game has an incredible tutorial system that it starts off with, and honestly, that was really cool. While it took me a little bit to understand what I was doing when it comes to the tutorial, let me explain that the fact that this is probably one of the easiest fighting games to be able to pick up. The only difference being is that each individual character has their own play style, and some of them are a little bit too faithful to the anime, which means they're not actually all that good. And when I say that, I'm talking about Zenitsu specifically. <laughs> Mizuno the game is incredibly gorgeous and it feels like I'm playing the anime, which honestly is exactly what we're doing, but still you get my point. There's only one real issue is that I wish we could move faster through the exploration sections of the game. But other than that, this game is actually incredibly fun, easy to pick up, and one of my favorites of this year so far. You can actually unlock literally everything in the game just by playing and getting S ranks on all of the story missions. So by playing the game, you're able to unlock every single character with relative ease. There's even a training mode where the character of choice becomes your instructor. Then as you rank up from one through 10, the instructor will then get progressively more difficult, allowing you to learn how to counter that character with whatever you choose. Considering the footage that I currently have is only the beginning of the game, I was using Sabito and honestly, it was just incredibly fun. The low times on this game were absolutely instant, especially since I was playing on the PS5. I'm personally not sure how the game runs on PC, but I would only assume that if it runs this well on PS5, it would I would hope that it runs just as well on PC. <laughs> Oh, my God.
each character has their own ultimate art finish. And let me just tell you, that's also just blows my mind. I'm currently in the process of unlocking everything in the game and then also capturing some footage for the versus mode so I can actually put out an official review. But what I can say right now is that based on what I played so far, which is chapters one through seven of the game and the one versus match that I wound up playing on PS5, this is by far one of my favorite anime based fighting games that I've ever played. It's going to be hard to top some of the Budokai games from the PS2 era. As far as style, ease of access, control schemes, the amount of playable characters to start and how every character interacts with each other, a very interesting parry system, the grabbing systems not easily cheesable, and how quick the actual matches are. This is an incredible fighting game for someone like me. So I urge you all to pick this up because it's honestly just a really good game and good games deserve to be praised. If for nothing else, then to experience the playable version of the Demon Slayer anime. If you guys want my official review of the game, please leave a comment and like down below and I'll be going over everything from the arcs that it covers and how they get covered from the reward system and all 18 playable characters as well as their arts finish. Thank you guys again for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. I'm out. そのじゃ、またな。任せろ。